Kind of bobble coming out of there, took off the speed. It's just the wrench is just a, sometimes a little bumpy coming out of there. So she'll make par at nine. Yeah, damp fairway, but they're lift clean in place. This from 163. Oh, you could see the moisture coming out of the ground with that divot. Good shot. Yeah, sure is. Stroke looked good. I'd Club say the rate was pretty good. <laughs> yeah. On a good line. Oh, my. Yeah, great line. And that will be for birdie to get to 12 under. Now, Castron for that birdie at 12. Uh, no need to read this one <laughs> straight in from three feet. All right, what a spectacular three after that tee shot. Trip Eisenhower's with this group. Looks like Castron next, second shot. 125 yards. This looks good in the air. Looks pretty good on the ground, too. Nice shot there. Wow. Back to back. Beautiful putt there. Lydia goes laughing about it. Here's Matilda Castron trying to stay close to Lynn Grant. Trying to draw in. Incredible day here. Second one this week that she's had. All right, Castron for the bogey. Okay. So let's see if she can maybe get one back at 16. But second bogey of the day. Just a moment ago at 16, the second for Matilda Castron. 163 yards. And another quality iron shot. That's her bread and butter. Yeah. It's all about controlling her spin right now. Uh-huh. Yeah, I'd say she did a pretty good job with that. Excellent shot. Yeah. Well, so it was just a moment ago, so a couple good birdies at 17 for these. It's not easy to try and shoot, only be the second woman to shoot 59. Tee shot for Matilda Cashman at 18. Important one to get it out there. It's wet, but you can get there with a good tee shot. <laughs> Easiest hole for the week. But a frustrating closing bogey for Matilda Castron. <laughs> 